Coastal defense artillery has been an important equipment for countries to defend their coastlines and control straits for the past few centuries. Despite the fact that various missiles and aircraft have become the main focus of video programs today, coastal defense artillery is still used as a main equipment by many countries. Finland's 13053TK is such a piece of equipment. The 13053TK was developed in the 1970s when the Finnish Defense Committee planned to develop a new coastal defense artillery to replace the original 152mm cannon. Eventually, the caliber of the cannon was set at 130mm in order to use the same ammunition as the mobile coastal artillery's 130K-54 towed cannon. After about 10 years of development, it was successfully developed and obtained an official production contract in 1982. The 13053 TK is actually a defensive turret weapon system installed on a permanent coastal defense position. It weighs about 16 tons and the polygonal armored turret provides basic protection for the gun crew. It can rotate 360 degrees, and the main gun is a 130mm cannon with a barrel length of 53 calibers, equipped with a muzzle brake. The cannon is equipped with an automatic loading system, allowing it to fire three rounds within 20 seconds during rapid fire, and the rate of fire decreases to six rounds per minute during sustained fire. It fires separate loading ammunition, with a muzzle velocity of approximately 860 meters per second, which decreases when reducing the amount of propellant. When firing conventional ammunition, its maximum range is 27 kilometers, and it can reach 40 kilometers when using extended range ammunition. The initially equipped ammunition is conventional high explosive fragmentation shells, which can be equipped with time fuses, impact fuses, or delay fuses, indicating that they are designed for different targets. The expected targets should be amphibious landing ships, boats, amphibious tanks, and other small and medium-sized surface targets, while large surface vessels are dealt with by anti-ship missiles. One 13053TK requires a 10-person team to operate, including three commanders and seven soldiers. The gun crew can measure targets using a laser rangefinder, but it still retains optical triangulation equipment because the latter does not emit a laser beam, making it more covert and allowing for more sudden artillery strikes. Unless unexpected circumstances arise, the 13053TK will become Finland's final fixed coastal artillery. The turret is installed on a permanent fortification, which includes corresponding ammunition depots, dormitories, and other spaces. The 13053TK, along with air defense weapons and anti-ship missiles, forms Finland's coastal defense system. The status of coastal defense artillery is no longer as prominent as before, but it is still necessary to exist. The Battle of Yonpyong Island is a good example where it still played a major role in a limited conflict. However, in higher-level combat operations, it can only play a supporting role. For example, in the Keski-19 exercise in 2019, the 13053 TK did not have the opportunity to engage in a cannon duel with the simulated enemy's large targets, but only played a role in anti-landing and other combat operations.